Hey everybody, I'm Rockin' Robin. Today I'm going to show you how to cut a head of cauliflower up. So we, we're going to remove these little florets so that they are nice and pretty. You know, they're not going to have those cut marks into them. It's super easy to do and I'll show you right after this. So before we get started, let me just mention that when you're picking these out in the store, they're usually covered in plastic wrap. And you want to look for uh, a nice even color. You want it to be just nice and creamy yellow like it is. And try to avoid those little brown spots. Now this one here does have a couple. There's a brown spot right here and there's a little black spot there. Not a big deal. I'm just going to take my knife and shave that off. I also want to mention that when you bring home a cauliflower from the store and it's wrapped in the plastic wrap, you want to store it right side up. Okay, where the leaves are down here below. And the reason for that is you're going to get a little condensation going on. And if it's upside down, all the condensation, the moisture is going to hit the bottom of this and, and make it get moldy. So if you keep it right side up, the moisture goes down to the bottom. Okay, just a little tip. Okay, so here's what you want to do. You see on the bottom here, you have all of these leaves. You want to peel those off and take them off. And what that's going to do is reveal the stalk so you can get in there and cut from this side, the bottom of the cauliflower. And now you can start to see, right in here, you can see the stalks of the cauliflower. And that's what I want to get access to. So I'm going to go ahead and take, I have a paring knife here, you can use any knife, and I'm going to cut those little florets out of there and just break them off. You see how nice and um, round they are? They don't look like they're cut at all. So that's basically what I'm going to do. I'm just going to come in here and trim these up. Did I mention that uh, cauliflower has a lot of vitamin C? It's supposed to be super healthy for you. And um, I've never been a super big fan of this, but I'm starting to uh, eat it now a little more frequently. It's great for uh, putting in your salad just raw like it is. That works. Make sure you rinse it. I haven't actually rinsed this yet. I'm going to do that after I cut all the florets off. And I've got a great recipe for you to try that I just came up with. And I tell you, I'll leave a link here on the screen so that you can click to that if you'd like to see that. It is super delicious. It's a great casserole. Um, it's got some really nice, it's like a comfort food because it has some cheese in it. It also has some bacon, which gives it some amazing flavor. So I hope you'll check that out. So you can see here, I'm just working my way around the cauliflower. That's what you end up with is that, that stock area. So we'll just toss that out. Okay, so back to cutting up our cauliflower. We're not exactly done yet, or we could be, but if you notice, some of my florets are small and some of them are rather large. That's just the way they came off of the stalk. So I'm gonna show you the best way to cut them so that um, it just looks a little nicer, okay? So have your little uh, floret upside down so that you've got the stalk area and just make a slit. Let's say you wanna cut that in half, okay? So put a little slit, don't cut all the way through, and then pull it apart. And what you end up with is a nice florette that doesn't have that, that sharp edge on it. So it looks nicer. Maybe that's important to you, maybe it's not. But if it is, that's what you want to do. And then, you know, if there's any brown spots, like over here, there's one little spot here. In fact, let's cut this one a little smaller. So just make a little slit and just pull it apart. See? And then that little brown spot I'm just gonna shave it off. You know, that one won't look so pretty, but that's okay. So basically, that's all there is to it. So you can make these more uniform in size, makes it better for cooking them as well. But just, yeah, just pull them apart. Much better than trying to cut it from the top down. So, all right guys, that's it for today. Uh, just a quick tip on how to do your cauliflower, and I hope it helps. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and leave me a comment. All right, we'll see you in the next video. Take care.